uni life is hard. And one of the worst things is exams. Even worse still are examiner comments. They can be really savage. So I sat down with my friend Shang to find the best that Cambridge has to offer. Yeah, did I, did I tell you about like this time, like my supervisor, my ex-supervisor for goodness sake, um, like he chased a girl up a tree, <laughs> like literally, I'm not kidding you. <laughs> Why? Why? Today we're going to take a look at some of the most savage examiner remarks ever from Cambridge. So Sam is going to, Sam has never seen these before. And he's gonna. Oh, that's a lie. I did first year too. God. <laughs> yeah, he 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 might he might have. But like, do we do we think Sam? Uh, has Sam done like all past twenty years of past year papers? Mm. Oh, you have. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I actually have. Dude, no, you're no, you're one. Of... No, no, no one is strong enough to have done that. Surely. <laughs> you're one of those. Okay. <laughs> oh. oh. Shameful. Okay, so let's start with the first one. Do you want to take a read, <laughs> Sam? Oh, I'll read it out, okay. There were many token attempts at this question, most likely a consequence of candidates committing too much time to the unnecessary integration by parts in the previous question. Hmm. For those serious attempts, it was mostly one answer. What? This isn't that savage. What? The, 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 is it the, token, to, the token attempts? <laughs> yes, yes, the focus is the serious attempts. And the token attempt. Oh, for the serious attempt. Oh, juxtaposition. Okay, I see. I see where you're going. Yeah, because like, yeah, most people just had token attempts, not even counted as attempts. You know. So yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, all right. We're starting off mild. Yeah. So. Oh, okay. We're gonna wrap it up each time. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we are. Okay, let's go. But some candidate tried to do part B by convolution, and sank without trace. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Oof. That's that's a and savage one. You, you know, you know when it, when it's handwritten, that's when you know that it's going to be a savage comment. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Especially the worse the handwriting is, the more savage it's likely to be. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It took me a while to read that, so. Yeah, yeah, because that because like the less people can actually decipher it, so they can do whatever they yeah. want. <laughs> yeah. Sank without trace. What what paper is this from? This is from maths, right? Oh. Yeah, convolution. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's a tricky God. one. Are you ready for the next one? Yes, I am. <laughs> Two candidates owned by undying admiration. Yeah, yeah. This, this, wait, wait, this, this is from like, uh, like my year, right? Because that was clearly my my solution. That's your solution. <laughs> That's clearly my solution. My undying admiration. For sure, for I, sure. I, I had, yeah, I had a teacher tell me that before. For, for doing the quadratic and I factorized it and had like, I had to rationalize thirds and I was like, oh my God. I think it was a backhanded compliment in the sense of, I was just doing a really, really bad method. <laughs> yes, <But> yes. <laughs> admiration, admiration. You always take that. Yeah, you always, you know like when, when, your, when a professor gives you undying admiration, <laughs> there's only one thing you yeah. can do. Just take it and run. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, candidates murdered this question. That's short and sweet. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not sure what, what needs to be said, other than maybe the question was too hard. <laughs> yeah, maybe like the examiner murdered the candidates, not the other way around. Yeah. Oh, all right. Yeah, that's, that is savage. We are, oh, we are getting into them now. Oh my god. Once again, relatively few went back to the wholly reliable method of drawing a free body diagram for parts of the beam. And I've come to suspect that weak supervisors may encourage their weak students to guess rather than going back to <laughs> Oh my god. That's double oh, savage days. This is this is uh I mean you can probably like bleep his name when I say it. This is a hundred percent. Oh there is, oh. <laughs> there is no way that this is not we love you, but as always. Weak supervisors and weak students. 
Weak students, like I'm fine with that. <laughs> weak supervisors. Oh my god, no uh, way. Yeah. Have you had like really bad supervisors? No, every supervisor is a lovely person. <laughs> like, wow, that's I amazing. Mean, like, they're not lo okay, they're not all lovely, but they're like you know they're intelligent and wise and like care about their subjects and like like what more do you want? <laughs> You're a lucky man. I've not been chased up any trees yet. <laughs> oh, that's good. That's good. Yeah, we'll we'll wait for next year. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <laughs> okay, next one. A significant number solved B first and worked back to A, which of course which is of course acceptable and it confirms the adage that in structural mechanics some of us are strain people and some of us are stress people. <laughs> Personally I'm a uh, young modulus kind of guy, so Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, that's that's a great one. You're never that that's never getting old. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but but I think one thing that can be confirmed is that some of us may be strained people, some of us may be stressed people. But like certainly all of us are, are strained and stressed when it comes to exams. So yes. at the same yeah. time, yeah. Yeah. Huh. Disappointingly, a number of candidates wrote equations that did not correspond to the required solution and then magically reproduce the final result. I mark such dishonesty down heavily. Oh no. <laughs> it's a classic savage one. Magically produce the final You know what though? Like, there's nothing wrong with if they if they say what the final result is, there's nothing wrong with just putting down some <laughs> that gets you to that final result. Cause it's not it's better than leaving it blank. I'm just gonna say for all those people watching this, for Cambridge advice, that that's advice. Yeah, yeah, I would totally <laughs> agree. Like that's some that's some like best Cambridge advice that you can ever give. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and you'll get marked down for being dishonest, but you know, whatever. We don't we don't care about that. It'll still give you some marks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's either like dishonesty or like. And some marks are like absolutely no marks, but at least you're honest. <laughs> so yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Time to make another video after this, doing these questions. These. Oh <laughs> these no! Oh, I, dude, I'm <laughs> actually gonna fail that one. <laughs> like, yeah. No. Yeah, because because these 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 are obviously coming from like some of the worst questions like that you can find. Oh, that is you, true. You, yeah. You do not get examiner comments this like weird and bad without having hard questions. Ah, uh, okay, that's true, that's true. Maybe next maybe next video idea. Comment down next below video, if you guys want to yeah. see that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is a long one. Oh yeah, comments. Speaking of comments. <laughs> this is similar to the question on the example sheet, and most candidates did reasonably well. Inevitably, arithmetic mistakes were rife, and with the high powers involved, there was a widespread of numbers. One found a crack extension. Oh god, it's materials. Oh. <laughs> 10 to the minus 55 millimeters, which I think is a record low. Well, that's shorter than the plank length, right? That's shorter than, like, you can get. <laughs> yeah, actually. Um, <laughs> fortunately, the examiner does not have to make a living out of designing pressure vessels. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Wait, what is, what is the idea of, like, 10 to the power of minus 55? It's like, what, how big is an atom even? <laughs> like, yeah, well, you know, we all, we all know that atoms are like on the, I want to say nano, maybe very big femto scale, which is like 10 to the minus 9, 10 to the minus 10, right? I yeah, think. yeah, exactly. <laughs> this, this is like, <laughs> what? And then, and, then you, and then you've got like the Planck length, which I'm not a physicist, but like, I'm pretty sure that's as small as you can, it, no, it's as small as it's, like reasonable to make any length, right? Like smaller than that is just useless. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's just ridiculous. It's so funny. If I were them, I'd just, I, if I see 10 to the minus 55, I'd just go like, well, guess I missed a factor of 10 to the 50 somewhere. <laughs> so just write 10, 10 to the minus five and be like, yeah, that's a good, that's a, that's a good approximation. Yeah. yeah, more exam techniques from Sam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel that's like you should have a compilation of all of them. By the end of this. <laughs> <Some techniques>. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, sure. Wow, you've got a lot of quotes. I have fewer than this. Like all design questions, this is much more difficult than it looks until you see the answer. Most candidates forgot to multiply by mass, i.e. G. Oh. Oh, m mass by G. Okay, more damaging. Mass by G. Oh. 
Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, uh, in my first year in progress test, I did a really similar mistake to this. It was to do with the block being pushed by uh, pressure. Yeah. Uh, like water pressure. And uh, I forgot that you have to, because there was like friction and stuff, but I forgot that the block had weight. Oh. So my, my, my solution was like really easy, and I was like, how is this question so easy? Because I, just, like, <laughs> neglected, I neglected like the 100 kilogram weight of the block that was being pushed. Oh, so you <laughs> only had to try. Huge, huge rip. Yeah, it's really wow. huge <laughs> rip. But, but at least, you know, we, we learn from our mistakes, yeah. Uh. Yeah. Learn from your mistakes. <laughs> I think this might be the last one. Yeah, so that's it. That's it. Yeah. Oh, I survived. I survived these questions. Yes, yes, you oh. did. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yay. Okay. That's great. Haha. <laughs> do you want to film an outro? Here you go. Sorry? Do you want to film an outro or is it like an outro? This is this is your outro, right? Oh, you're no outro. You're out. Oh, it's my outro. Cause oh, well, you can you can make you can make a great edit from this because I'm just completely clueless that I'm supposed to be doing an outro. Wait, what? this is your video, right? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, oh, wait, oh, am I? Wait, which one's going on my channel? The one reacting to yours? The just, yeah. just now, that one. Yeah, 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 that one's on my channel, yeah. So yeah, it's yeah. your outro, right? <laughs> so, okay, well, I think I've messed up the outro enough for it to be a good ending to the video. No. <laughs> okay, yeah, anyway. Damn, what a confusing ending. Anyway, since you made it to the end of this video, you may as well check out Shang's complimentary video. It's probably a little bit better than mine.